EA Sports. It's in the game. What's up, Madden fans, and welcome to the Madden NFL 12 Playbook. We got six major feature announcements all leading up to the launch of Madden NFL 12 on August 30th. But this year, we're going to do it a little bit differently. We brought in Sam Bradford, Reggie Bush, Darrell Revis, Clay Matthews, and even our Hall of Fame cover athlete, Marshall Falk, to walk you through some of these major, major improvements. And even better, we're doing it inside the Emmy Award winning ESPN Virtual Playbook. So you'll actually get to see us and our favorite NFL players on the field talking about Madden. Enjoy. So this year in Madden NFL 12, we're making a reinvestment in the franchise mode. We've heard everything that you guys in the community have had to say. I've got my man Josh Lumen here who's going to help walk us through some of those improvements that we've made straight from some of the requests that you've had. So Josh, let's, let's walk these guys through what, we, what we've got here. Yeah, I mean the first thing you're seeing here is the brand new hub in franchise mode. New visual look, um, definitely quickly lets you get into your games. Um, add a lot of other really cool stuff in, in franchise mode. Um, among those things are uh, hot and cold streaks. Um, we've got all the traits and tendencies for the player, so it's going to really make your players play differently every single week, um, kind of impact how they play in the game, and uh, revolutionize franchise play. So the, the hot and cold streaks, that's the idea, right, of, of persistence from, from game to game. So for someone like last year, Michael Vick, who has a three-game stretch that he's absolutely on fire, it, explain how that's going to translate into the next game. Yeah, the big thing is, is we take a look at a player's performance after the game, the entire team, and we determine if they're on a hot or a cold streak. We let that carry forward into upcoming weeks and really kind of uh, set the tone for your season as you go along. And it's not just like a, you know, I'm either hot or cold. There, there, there's layers within, right? Correct, yeah. I mean, you've got hot and cold and you've got some sort of in-between medium stuff. And, and again, it's evaluating how players have played and then carrying forward into the next week for that. All of our community feedback that we've received over the last year, we're trying to make the greatest hits list, the greatest request list, and bring that into this year's game, starting with expanded rosters. Yeah, that's big. I mean, that is probably the number one feature over the years that people have asked us to add. Um, we now have teams getting up to 75 players in-game swapping out the depth charts um, each week during the preseason you're going to have to cut down to a predetermined amount of players you're going to see a question mark next to the guys overall each week you're going to unlock a couple more ratings get you closer to his overall but you're going to have to be making those tough decisions along the way and decide do i cut this guy do i keep him on the roster and if you have to cut him in week three and somebody else picks him up i mean you know, that's kind of the story of the NFL. Another big improvement we made to franchise this year is all about the draft. Josh, talk a little bit about what we've done differently this year. Yeah, I mean, we focused a lot on the draft this year. We completely redid the rookie scouting feature. Um, it goes to the regular season, to the combine, to individual workouts. Brand new system for scouting rookies. Um, a big feature people have asked for for years is future draft picks. So you can now trade next year's draft picks along with this year's. Added that. We worked a lot on draft logic. So now, um, a really cool thing you might see is if the Raiders get into the draft, they have a choice between, between two wide receivers. One's got 99 speed, one's got 90 speed. They're going to lean more towards the guy that has the higher speed. Um, really kind of focus on making sure the logic's a lot smarter, um, feels a lot more immersive, and just overall really focusing on the drafting process. So the Raiders are going to draft like the Raiders? They are, in fact. Yeah, they love physical skills and strong guys, fast guys, that kind of stuff. And we're trying to emulate that in franchise mode. True to the franchise, true to Al Davis, true to the game. Madden NFL 12. True to the franchise. True to Reggie Bush. True to Clay Matthews. True to Sam Bradford. True to Reva Island. True to the game.